guys. Thanks for tuning in to another episode of Cheryl's Home Cooking. So let's get started. Welcome to Cheryl's Home Cooking. And today what I'm going to show you is how I make my homemade Three Musketeers candy bar. So you'll need seven ounces of marshmallow fluff, about two thirds of chocolate spread or Nutella. I'm using the chocolate spread and 12 ounces of chocolate, which I'm using the almond bark. So I'll take half of the chocolate, put it in my microwave and melt it until it's nice and smooth. My chocolate melted beautifully. This is what you're looking for. So now I'll place that off to the side. On my baking dish, I'll place some parchment paper. I'll coat my parchment paper with some cooking spray. Now I'll take my chocolate pour it onto my parchment paper and then spread it evenly And you'll place this in your fridge for about 15 minutes or until nice and hard. So now I'll place this in my fridge for about 15 minutes or until nice and firm. While my chocolate is in the fridge getting hard, I have 7 ounces of marshmallow fluff and 2 thirds cup of chocolate spread. I'll mix this together. I'll place this in my microwave for about 30 seconds or until it's nice and smooth and combined. Now I'll just mix the chocolate spread into the marshmallow. These Three Musketeers are really good. They taste just like the real thing, too. That's what it looks like. So now that my marshmallow and chocolate spread is combined, I'll go get my chocolate out of the fridge. It firmed up beautifully. So now I'll place the marshmallow and chocolate spread on top and spread this out.
just want it coated evenly. Now you'll take the rest of your chocolate, place this in a microwave until melted, and then I'll pour it on top. So to make these three musketeers, the only ingredients that you'll need is seven ounces of marshmallow fluff, two thirds cup of chocolate spread or Nutella, whichever you prefer. I use the chocolate spread, and 12 ounces of melting chocolate. And that's all there is to it. Once my chocolate is melted in the microwave, I'll pour it on top, cover the sides, and then I'll place this in the fridge until about 20 minutes, 15, 20 minutes, or until firm. And then you can slice them up into bars. See how quick and easy this was to make homemade Three Musketeers? My chocolate melted up beautifully. I'll mix it all up. Pour it on top. making sure to cover the marshmallow and the chocolate spread. See how quick and easy this was? So now that all the marshmallow and chocolate spread is covered, I'll place this back in my fridge for about 15 to 20 minutes or until firm. And then we're having three musketeer candy bars. Look at how beautifully that firmed up. So now I'll take it, place it on my cutting board, take it off the parchment paper, See how easy that lifted up? So now I'll slice them into bars. I'll slice them into bite size. Look at how good that came out. Mmm. Really good. They're really good. I'll just line them up on my plate. You can place them in an airtight container and they'll last about a week. that looks. Perfect. I'll place a little piece of parchment paper on top and continue lining up the rest of the bars. 
I made them into little bite size. Look at how good that nougat looks inside. Look at how perfect they came out. Thanks for watching and I hope you give these a try. They're really quick and simple and so good. I'll see you next video. Bye bye. Thank you so much for tuning in to another episode of Cheryl's Home Cooking. It really means a lot to me. Please follow me on YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest, Facebook, and hit the like button, and especially iFood.tv. I'll see you all next video. Bye-bye.